entrepreneurs in Kashmir. Jammu and Kashmir has a total of 10,700 registered female entrepreneurs and around 97% of them are from Kashmir region. The overall share of 96.75% of women entrepreneurs of the state being from Kashmir is a healthy sign for women empowerment in the valley compared to Jammu, otherwise considered to be more liberal than the valley. In comparison, the 2.75% share of women entrepreneurs from Jammu and 0.5% from the cold desert region of Ladakh is negligible. 10,355 of these women were from the valley, 295 from Jammu and 50 from Ladakh. Of the 10,355 women entrepreneurs from Kashmir, Srinagar has a major share with 4,293, 2,219 for Badgam, 1,306 for Pulwama, 918 for Gandharbal, 748 for Kulgam, 320 for Kapwara, 285 for Shupaya, 124 for Anatna, 75 for Bandipura, and 67 for Baramura. Of the 295 women entrepreneurs from Jammu region, 13 from Jammu district, and the major share of 127 is from Udhampur. 42 are from Doda, 39 from Riyasi, 32 from Kotwa, 15 from Rajori, 11 from Punch, 9 from Samba, 6 from Ramban, and 1 from Kishtavar. Similarly, the major share of 43 female entrepreneurs in Ladakh region is from Leh district, while the rest 7 are from Kargil. Women Development Corporation has launched many schemes at grassroots level in JNK to train the women for earning their livelihood. Till date, 6,500 women have been trained by us and they are entrepreneurs now in different fields. They are earning their living by producing different products to ensure their success. Central team regularly visits to them and assists them. Most of the women entrepreneurs in Kashmir have set up business units of handloom women. Pashmina spinning, Kani shawl weaving, and ready-made garments. In Jammu region, besides the handloom weaving, ready-made garments, and Pashmina spinning, women have set up common facility centers and mat weaving units. While in Ladakh region, women entrepreneurs are setting up multi-purpose training centers. Presently, women are running 47 training centers in Kashmir region. While women in Jammu region run 42 such centers and in Ladakh, women are running 13 centers. We try to find out how female entrepreneurs of Valley achieved their goals and are running successfully their business units, giving livelihood to many females like her and we met Mowgli, who is in her 40s. Mowgli runs handicraft unit which she starts a decade before. Today around 20 females are working in her unit and earning livelihood. When I was married, I came here, I developed a mindset about the kind of a business unit known as handicraft. Usually here, women are typically seen as the homemakers. I started a campaign and aware those women you can earn with your hands. For that time, I am giving training to women there. Government is providing all type of assistance to these women. Like in minority scheme, we provide them financial assistance, which is different from bank loan, and the money is without interest for five years. We train women in cutting, tailoring, fashion, and other fields. When training ends, we link the women with different schemes so that they are benefited. Similarly, in National Backward Corporation and Physically Handicapped Women are also brought under different schemes. Apart from job creation, we also provide education loan for girls and the rate of interest is very low to ensure their quality education. Rubina Fayaz, who works with Mowgli, says, Since she started work with Mowgli, she is no more dependent on her family. Rubina says, Girls in Kashmir are full of talent like boys. And if people like Mowgli explore their talent, most of females will be earning half. I am working from since 4 years. I learned this work. I am student of 12th standard and also works in a short time. If I did not got job in my future, then I can start my own business. Like Rubina, Taslima who also works with Mowgli, she says, after her marriage, she was idle at home. 
Later she met Mowgli and started work in her unit. Taslima says Female who remain idle at home can make better use of their time besides make good sums. I feel privileged that I met Mowgli here and she taught me this work and because of Mowgli I am able to earn my livelihood. Today not only me but my relatives are also working here and they are also earning their livelihood. Now they can do their own business. They are thankful to me. Amid claims of government for promoting and supporting entrepreneurship in the state, there is need to educate people, especially women, about the benefits of entrepreneurship amid growing unemployment matters. For debt awareness programs and publicity of schemes are need of the hour to get rid of employment crisis besides to make our females independent for better life.